Hi everybody, this is Doris with Rich and Love Fashion. On this week's episode of Dose of Doris, we're gonna be talking about the power of me time. Okay, what is me time? Well, before we get into it, I wanted to share a very interesting study done by the New York Post back in 2016. Yes, things have changed since then. The poll was about 2,000 Americans that were all in relationships and 82% of them reported that getting the proper me time help the relationship. 58% said they encouraged their partner to go have me time. The study kind of caught me off guard because we live in a society where we enjoy the interaction with one another from drinking, mingling, kissing, hugging, you name it. And as we all know, 2020 has given us nothing but roadblocks to stop that interaction with one another. But maybe on the flip side, 2020 has also gifted us that opportunity to learn what me time really is. And the study also went further into the amount of time people enjoy for me time. And the study revealed 51 minutes. So 51 minutes a day for personal me time. Um, for myself, I actually enjoy more. So please leave in the comments below, how much time of me time do you enjoy and what do you enjoy doing in that me time? What is the right calculated time for you to have this me time? And just remember, taking time for yourself, it's not selfish. It's not a bad thing. And I think sometimes we think it is, but it's really not. It's much needed. And as the study proves, 51 minutes can make all the difference in your relationship and in your personal life. So why not take 51 minutes for yourself every day? You deserve it. Thank you for watching this week's episode of Dose Doris. Additional information can always be found by visiting richandlovefashion.com. Please support the channel by sharing and subscribing. And until we meet next time, remember to always stay glamorous.